Now, we know how to take the derivative of x squared because it's really similar to what we've been doing in the first two problems. We know how to take the derivative of x because really that's x to the first power. So we know how to take the derivative of this and this. So notice that since they're added together, we're taking the derivative of the whole thing. All we do is we take the derivative of each part and just add them together. We take the exponent down to right x and then for our exponent here, it's going to be to the first power. 2 minus 1 is 1. So we leave a 1 here. What about this guy? Well, we have an implied 1 in the exponent, so a 1 comes down. So we have a 1 coming down, and then we have an x, and then the exponent is going to be 1 minus 1. And what is anything to the 0 power when you think about it? Anything to the 0 power is always 1. f prime of x is equal to 2x plus 1. 2x plus 1. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.